Hey students, Mr. Murphy here. So we are talking about math this year in class. Yes, this is a picture of me now. This is a picture of me when I was a kid. One thing I want you to know, we have this math website up here. It has lots of resources, so go visit it anytime you're confused. Before you get this, I'll put in the email and the phone. Well, the email's here, my Twitter's here. Schoology is our new learning management system. It's not set up yet, but by the time you get this, that will be a link, okay? What you're gonna learn in eighth grade, I've talked about in a different video, but you can refer to it here. This year is gonna be crazy. Um, we will probably go remote sometime this year. So I'm gonna run the whole class as if we're remote all the time, even when we're in class. So all my lessons will have a video, all my homework will be able to be done online. I have the website I talked about. It's online, ready to go, with lots of resources and lots of teaching. The student workbook is linked here. If you forget yours or lose yours, you can always click on this and print out the pages you need. We will also supplement with Khan Academy and a thing called Assistments, which is all of the homework and tests and everything online. So you can always do it online or in class. Um, one thing you need to know, everyone can learn math. My job is to make it less scary for you. Your job is to ask for help when you need it. Try again and again and again. And if you're stuck, watch my video or watch a different video. Google what you're learning. Somebody's got written a word, web page on it or made a new video and it may be better than mine. So. Google it. There's so many ways to learn the math that you should not be waiting for me or say you can't do the homework because you don't understand it because it's out there. Look for it. All right, some rules in school for my class. Treat each other as you would treat yourself. And if you don't treat yourself well, then you have to start loving yourself, okay? Put in your best effort and then try one more time. No more of this, I'm put turning in blank work, or I, I'm putting in IDK, or scribbling something and turning it in. I can't pass you if you don't do the work. Uh, yes, you can redo everything and turn it in on the last day of the quarter, but when it's due, you get an F until it's done well, okay? Turn in the work right away even if it's not perfect, because I'm going to give you feedback on how to do it better, as long as it's not a scribble. You know, if you put an honest effort and then got it wrong, I can say where you got stuff wrong and give you hints on how to get it better, and then you can redo it the next day and turn it back in, okay? Uh, mathematical thinking goes along this line. Basic three basic things on mathematical thinking. You have to identify the question. What are we asking? Identify what you need to know to solve the question, and then break it into little pieces that you can do. Math is four things: adding, subtracting, multiplying, dividing. Every problem you see in eighth grade can be broken down into those four operations. Okay. Your grades are based on what you do. If you miss a, a problem or you do badly on homework or a test, you can redo it. You don't get extra credit to make up. You just redo what you did anytime up until the end of the quarter. Uh, if you know you can't do tests because you're slow on tests or you you freeze up, then talk to me. We can make a project for you and you can prove to me that you can do it in a different way. Maybe you're going to record a video like this and show me how to do it instead of doing it on the test in the class. Okay. I will give you feedback on everything as fast as I can so you can make corrections and turn it back in. There's no reason not to get an A. I also hate homework, but it is practice and practice makes it better. And if you participate in class, class will be more fun and time will go faster. Remember, I have emotions too. I get happy and sad and angry just like anyone else. So let's treat each other the way we want to be treated. Good luck.